Welcome back to Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo, and today is Thursday, April 5th, 2018. And let's find out what's going on in the world of bodybuilding and fitness. Bodybuilding is one of the few things in life that you can't fake being good at, because once those lights come on, the truth has a way of showing up in a hurry. But luckily for him, second year pro Ricky Moten Jr. is good enough that he doesn't have to fake it. This week, the former USA men's physique champ turned classic physique crossover dropped his latest round of updates as he gears up to make his season debut a few weeks from now at the New York Pro. According to Moten and his team, this move to classic finally gave him the room he needed to grow and fill out his frame. So come next month, we'll get our chance to see if he's ready to square off against what's shaping up to be one of the best lineups of the season. Last week, the U.S. decided it was time to send 60 Russian diplomats an unceremonious exit from the country. But thankfully for women's physique fans, it doesn't look like that's going to bother emerging Russian-born women's physique standout Machina Valentina. A few weeks removed from putting together a solid fourth place effort at the Atlantic Coast Pro, it looks like she's starting to load up for round two of her 2018 campaign. Earlier this week, we talked to sources inside the Valentina camp who told us that her next stop will be the Orlando Europa Pro, a little less than three weeks from now, where she'll bring a smaller, more streamlined look. From front to back, Valentina has enough weapons in her arsenal to do some serious damage. So if she can deliver what the judges are asking for, I think she's a real dark horse to come in and possibly steal the show. Every so often you see a guy flash at one of those early season shows and you can immediately see that it looks like there might be something special there, which is exactly how a lot of people are feeling right now about rising classic physique star Chen Kang. A few weeks after his breakout second place performance at the New Zealand Pro, China's hottest export looks like he's starting to pick up steam again. New photos from deep inside Team Kang show the former Asian Beach Games gold medalist looking like a small tank as he and his team start to calculate their next move. Even from a quick glance, you can see that Kang's got some body parts that can make him very dangerous in the right lineup. So if he can pick his spots correctly and tighten up that conditioning just a little, look out for this guy to make some noise at some point later this season. Right now, things are looking bright in the world if you happen to be a Toronto sports fan. But hopefully all those excited Raptor fans up there in the six have some gas left in the tank to give Classic Physique star Terrence Ruffin some love when he comes to town a few weeks from now. Late Monday night, some new training clips surfaced from the Ruffin camp, where we see the two-time Olympian celebrating International Chess Day with a few heavy sets of inclined dumbbell presses. From the updates we've seen over these last few weeks, Ruffin seems like he's right up on track to come in and deliver one of those vintage performances he's become known for over the last two seasons. And if this guy gets it going down the back half of his prep, it's hard not to consider him one of the early favorites to take home the gold. And that does it for yet another edition of Muscle in the Morning. I'm Dave Palumbo, reminding you to always be true to your passions. And make sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram.